Hey guys, Scott with BWSR Bushcraft here. Today we're just doing a little uh, scout about, looking for a cottonwood tree so I can locate some uh, dead and down of which to make a bow drill set out of. So hang tight, be right back, we'll get started. We've got a couple of them over here this way. You can, uh, you can tell that it's cottonwood by the way the leaves flutter in the breeze here. Well, I got something I think I can uh, make a spindle with. Let's take this uh, bark off here. It's pretty straight, actually. I think and it's got a little bit of a little bit of a curve to it. It's a good size getting kind of smaller up here. I think it's uh I think it's pretty good. I, th I think it's pretty good here. Um yeah cut it off here. That's enough for a spindle. I'm gonna uh I'm gonna take this piece with me um because I've learned some some time ago that uh you know, you might think that if, if you find something that you would come back and get it later. Um, a lot of times later, <laughs> never comes back. So I always just like to take what I find with me. If I find something better, I can always leave this. So thus so far is uh, what I have for a spindle. Let's go see if we can uh, find something uh, perhaps a little bit uh, more abundant. grass here. The uh, rattlesnakes are out uh, this time of year most definitely. We're uh, right here in the middle of August. So uh, Definitely want to be watching our feet here. See all the dead leaves. Boy, there's there's an abundance right here. Look at this. I think we found our hearth, guys. Well, I 
I think I found the material for the hearth. It's going to be right here. Make a nice hearth right there. Now I'm going to take a walk down to the river and see if I can find a flat rock with a bit of a divot in it for the uh, bearing block. This right here is something. What we're looking for, but the rock is just a little bit big and heavy. So what we want to do is find a rock that's got something like this but a lot flatter. divot in it, small enough to fit the palm of my hand. All right. Well, let's go, uh, 
Let's go see if we can find some shade. And, um, I'll just cut this spindle down a little bit. We'll debark that heart. And, uh, kind of uh, start putting it together. This tree is about 15 feet or so away from the river, the water. The leaves are just a lot, compared to the other one, the leaves are a lot bigger, more fuller, more vibrant with the green. They have a bit of a dull side and a bit of a shiny side to them. When, uh, when you find that cottonwood next to the water, they just they, well, they just they just take it up. Using that divot, it helps just smooth out the uh, fireboard or hearth in, and then just rub it on that rock. <laughs> 